What's up, everybody? It's your boy, Crash X Monkey of Nocturnal Supremacy. Um, I'm out here right now. We we actually went to the grocery store. I bought a, I bought some ingredients to make some kare kare. So uh, that's gonna be what's gonna be happening <laughs> in a bit. But um, anyways, uh, today's gonna be the last time uh, I get to hang out with my parents. They already um, let go of the place they're living, and then I'm gonna drop them off on Tuesday. So. Intro. So, so today, um, yeah, like I was saying, we're gonna be uh, hanging out with my parents. Uh, my in-laws are coming too, to say, you know, to hang out with them. So it's like, um, it's like a what's it called in English? Despedida. Um, I'll. Just add the translation editor, <laughs> please. And then, um, yeah, so it's gonna be the last time I get to hang out with them. Uh, to be honest, like in all honesty, I'm gonna miss them a lot. It's gonna be, um, it's not, we're not gonna be used to it. Basically, it's, they're, I feel like, actually I do have relatives here, but I don't see them. Often, every time there's an occasion, it's always my parents. They're always here, you know, my stepdad and my mom. My, my dad, uh, he's in the Philippines right now. Um, he usually comes here, but since of COVID, he wasn't able to like visit. Um, so hopefully he gets to visit this year and uh, we'll vlog that some other time. But um, yeah, right now it's, uh, to be honest, like what I really feel is when people go, oh, your parents are leaving for the Philippines, you know? It's not like, oh, you're gonna still see them, right? They're gonna come by and visit. I go, yeah, but that's not that. Um, my parents taught me like recently like a couple years, they've been telling me, um, we're not gonna live for long or we're sickly, and, you know. And I understand at first, you know, I can be in denial and be like, oh, it's okay, I understand. But um, they really wanted to make me prepared that I'm ready. I'm anytime in my life right now, I could lose them. So that's why I, I treat every moment very, it's like very, very precious to me. Um, if I don't like if they leave and something God forbid something happens when they're over there especially through COVID right now I'm gonna fucking I'm gonna fucking my heart's gonna drop you know so with every time like I have to spend with them while they're here especially the fact that um, they have always been there man like ever since I, I came back here to study and you know work until i got married and i had kids they're always there my parents man i've i love them i love them so much and the fact that it this could be the last time i get to like actually hang out with them or see them is you know it's sad because i'm i'm used to them they literally live not even like just down a couple blocks away from where we live and we're so used to making a turn down that street just to visit them and say hello so um it's gonna be weird and different and and honestly my mom was like i only just realized my wife's here she got a, uh, she got like her little her little uh frozen drink what did you get bush huh? what did you get uh avocado for me and strawberry for me around uh, okay, no. mm -hmm. so i'm really gonna miss um Hanging out with them. I'm talking about my parents last uh, last time hanging out with us. Um, Basically, their last week. Yeah, their last week. My da my stepdad's retired. My mom's retired. And yeah, so that's why I'm treating it like like this. Um, every weekend, I've been buying like really expensive whiskey. Right now, I got the Martell Gordon Cordon Blue Extra. It was like 280 bucks. Um, they're gonna love it. It's like fr it's French cognac. You know, but we drink it on the ice like we do with whiskey, and it's gonna be super delicious. I know already, because the blue Swift is really good. It's really, really good already. I had the Cordon Blue before, and that's fire. Uh, and then now we have this one. But yeah, basically that's how I feel. Um, hopefully, um, hopefully uh, they enjoy uh, what we have. I'm gonna make kare kare. My wife's gonna make um. Uh, green shell soup so it's like nilagang tahong 
and and then buko pandan she's making buko pandan too you know like all the stuff that they really love uh and then my in-laws i think they're getting cake and stuff so it's gonna be um it's gonna be fun fun get together because we always play like cards and stuff um yeah so basically that's that's what i've been really wanting to get out of my chest is just the fact that um you know they're old and I, I i i'm never i don't know when i'm gonna see them so my mom just it just hit my mom recently that when uh she just realized that when she leaves i'm gonna be alone here and i'm she pretty much said like i'm i'm leaving you here with no family i'm like it's okay i go i got i got dolly and the kids you know but she goes yeah but on your side like uh, you know, it just kicked in, and then she she was like about to cry, and she has a heart problem. So I said, "Don't cry, don't cry. It's gonna be okay. I'm gonna be fine." But I have to say that because I don't want her to have a hard time. You know, she invested so much into um, building her house in the Philippines, being able to look super modern and beautiful. That if um if I have, if I'm selfish to tell her no, you can leave, but come back, you can stay. You know, it's 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 not fair. You know, she's tired. She's old. She's tired, and she wants to be happy. And I said, oh, let her be, her and my stepdad. Um, I said, uh, you know, it's just, I just like, I just want to comfort her, make sure everything's okay, and say that it's gonna be fine. But on on my end, like in all honesty, in my heart, uh, when I'm making this video, I'm gonna miss the hell out of my my parents uh, being here because I'm just so used to it, you know. Um, but they're gonna be okay they're gonna be fine and i if you guys are watching this now i love you guys with everything that you helped us out here you know we wouldn't have made it or gone through even my dad in the philippines you guys helped us out so much um uh now i gotta just me and my wife we we've talked to each other we just really gotta step it up and you know uh and keep doing what we're doing but it's just gonna be different but we'll be okay we'll be okay I love you guys. I love you, mom. I love you, Tito. And I love my dad a lot and hope to see my dad soon. Um, you guys will be fine. We're, we're going to be fine. And uh, yeah, let's enjoy this day. Catch you guys later in the next scene. Yo, so this is my wife's special, Buko Pandan. Freaking awesome. Good job, baby. Good job. Yay! <laughs> Yay! <laughs> Yo, right now, I'm just stewing it up. I'm just boiling the flavor into the kare kare. In a bit, this is gonna change into this. Oh, there it is. Kare kare, baby. Kare kare. It's like a peanut sauce stew. Uh, every, every Filipino's uh, favorite. My wife's over here on the other side, you know? She's trying something. She's gonna make. Ooh, it's gonna be fire. Okay. My parents came over. My mom made her Dinuguan. Oh, <laughs> That's Dinuguan. I made the karakare. There you go. That's the buko pandan. The cake that my mother in law made. My mom made the bico. And they also brought egg roll and shrimp balls. Those are fire, yo. It's really fire. Super crunchy. Mmm. Mmm. Look at that. That's fire. Mmm. So I'm, um, I'm going to spend more time with my family. And then, um, yeah, I'm about to. I'm going to spend more time with my family. And then I'll catch you guys later. There you go, everybody. My, uh, wow. that's my stepdad, Tito Nono. He's about to open it. These two were trying to drop it. <laughs> but they were kidding. <laughs> my heart almost dropped. <laughs> there you go. I have to be careful now. Oh, oh. Oh, they have secret doors. Oh, oh. You have to knock on it. Wow. Knock, knock. <laughs> Wow! Let's go! Wow! Wow! One liter. Oh, wow! Three hundred thirty dollars retail price. Our regular price. 
Oh, oh, stop that. Hey, oh. stop. Oh. You better not. <laughs> What's the inside look like? Oh, just nice. And, oh, it even has that. Okay. You want me to put it on the freezer now? Yes, please. You know it. Cognac, baby. French right. cognac. Yes, sir. Thank you. Thank you very, very much. <laughs> of course, Tito. This. Of course, Tito. Wow. For you. <laughs> for us. Uh, Enjoy hi. it. Thank you. <laughs> No! <laughs> oh no! So guys, <laughs> we're all having fun. Um, I finally shaved, you know, your boy looking clean. Uh, you know, so we're about to uh, start drinking this uh, this very, very expensive bottle. Yo, I'm gonna let you guys know if it's really good. But um, this, this bottle right here. I want to make sure I don't drop this. Like, I hold it right. This, I don't know if it's going to be backwards, but it's Cordon Bleu Martel. French cognac. Super delicious. This is extra. Cordon Bleu extra. You know how much this ball costs? It's $330. Yo, I got it on sale. $280. Bucks. <laughs> my wife, my wife is on so just checking me out because I, I look fresh and smell good. <laughs> but yeah, we're gonna we're gonna drink this up and I'll let you guys know how it tastes. That's a good for shot no or bash no. You could, but uh, yeah. ice on the rock. Oh ice on the rock. Where's the cognac on the rock? Yeah. Cheers, everybody. Let's uh, let's try it out. That's really good. It's really smooth. It doesn't burn. It doesn't burn going down. But it hits. This shit hits, it's, but it's really good. I've never drank something like that before. But I know this is going to fuck me up. <laughs> but it's super good. That's less. Wow, that's, that's delicious. And when I say sweet, I don't mean candy sweet. This is a... Uh, wow. It's like sweet on the back of the tongue, and it's gone. Very smooth and creamy. I love it. I love it. I recommend it. I recommend it. This is really good. Yes. Hey, everybody. So, uh, I've, I've never actually made a video of me myself buzzed. But um, this, uh, this bottle is really good. But uh, <laughs> I'm uh, I'm still kind of I'm not gonna say sober because we did drink a lot, but it's it it keeps me awake. It doesn't make me sleepy. Mom, <laughs> this this vlog is about me spending time with you before you leave. All right. I love Thank my mom. You, Tito, Thank you, see Thank see you, you tomorrow. <laughs> my editor is gonna put this together. Please put it together. <laughs> So uh, we we just got to finish drinking, but we're gonna continue tomorrow, and then to be continued, to be continued, and that's all goes. We're gonna we're gonna we uh he he won every game. <laughs> we we love to play card games when we're drinking and you know family time. Uh, but yeah, um, I'm gonna take him outside. Later. I was there from the start, it's like you forgot who you are I've been who I am and you not who you are You say that I'm so hard to deal with this shit But you not a walk in the park Ice in my heart, don't care that you